You may have heard of a shady character by the name of Harry who fancies himself as Durban's number one con artist. Apparently, he's met his match in the Don of Saxon world. And Vikash Mathura and Jack Dev Narine are also up to some funny business. I wanted to get the inside story, so I attended the premiere in Josie. The precise location of the notorious Saxon world Shabin has been something of a mystery. But Zaki picked up a fresh lead about its new premises. Vikash Mathura and Jack Dev Narayan are giants of entertainment in their own right. Not only do I have the absolute privilege of chatting to both of them today, I also get to find out how their play, Harry and the Gupta, came about. Vikash and Jack were hard at work fine-tuning the lighting and music for their first performance, and Zaki took the opportunity to watch two masters of stage and screen in action. I am fangirling so hard. Hello, Zaki. Jackie. <laughs> Jackie. <laughs> I've been wondering where the Saxon Wall Shabin is for months now. Oh, yeah, right here on stage. Oh, okay. A, a, lot of, a lot of people don't know where it is, and security is going to throw us out because okay. media is not allowed inside Saxon Wall Shabin. So let's go talk outside. Okay. Vikash and Jack have known each other for over 30 years, but they have never worked together. But now they have produced and are starring in Harry and the Gupta, and I'm keen to find out how this all came about. Gentlemen, where did the idea originate from? We wanted to do something that was contemporary, that was current affairs, and something that we both could add our flavor and our talent to. All the political issues or the personalities who we make reference to are people and events that people can identify with but it's done in a very satirical way. Jack, how did you go about devising the show? It was a wonderful process of collaboration. Vikash and I sitting together for hours and hours, just applying ourselves to what we think is really, really funny. You've known each other for 30 years already. Why has it taken so long for you to collaborate? I think it's taken us that long to be able to find ourselves in our careers, own the path that we're at, and to be able to arrive at the journey that we want to embark on as a collaboration. We have this love for comedy, we have this love for interacting with live audiences, and we thought this is the perfect opportunity. I have to ask you both, what have been some of the challenges and highlights of working together? The biggest challenge we had was whenever we got together, we would laugh so hard at the kind of ideas we were coming up with that no scripting ever got done. <laughs> we would just laugh and but hold on. weeks. And we get to a point where we say we need to start making notes now. So it's been uh, yeah, it's been a job. It has been. I think some of the stuff that we left out is material for a whole new play. <laughs> An entire new show. <laughs> what about mixing business and friendship? I think we're both very professional. Um, yeah, and neither of us are friends. Yeah, <laughs> and that helps. The reality is, I think we're very committed to a product and are very committed to a show. So we both take criticism very well, just as much as we take compliments. But we, we're very critical of the input that each yeah. of us provides. And Vikash is really, really good at being critical. <laughs> Finally, I can leave Vikash on his own for this shot and just try and behave and be polite. I'm going to do my best. All right, I'm going to start my vocal warm-up. See you later. Enjoy your warm-up, Jackie. Vikash, what is the purpose of the show? There are so many serious things for us all to worry about, economically, socially, career, employment, unemployment, politically. Let's just get people in a room and make them laugh. That's what we do best. Vikash, break a leg out there. I'm going to go find Jack. It wasn't difficult to track down Jack, who puts all his energy into his character, even for a rehearsal. Jack, you are performing the show 30 times. How do you keep it fresh? It's a reality of uh, stage performance that every different audience you have presents a different energy. And we want to make sure that we are still hitting those important beats and staying true to what we created in the show. So yes, there will be lots of rehearsals. And in the process of rehearsing, we are quite sure that there are going to be updates in the news that's going to become new material for the stuff that we can then bring into the show. Break a leg out there. By now, word had spread that some of South Africa's most elusive crooks had been tracked down and the rush was on to reach them. Fans arrived looking forward to quick-witted, smooth-talking, topical comedy and they weren't disappointed. No, 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 no! Not Rajesh Kumar, that is TV guy! I, I am Rajesh Gupta, otherwise known as Tony. No, 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 I keep telling you people in the media, I do not give interviews. If you're looking for official statement, let me tell you where to get it. Dubai! 
It is open. Come in, yar. Mr. Gupta, I never expect to see you here, yes, sir. Sorry. I just brought that. I think you hired cheap contractors for your front door. <laughs> this, this is Saxon world, Shabin, boss. Mr. Gupta, the mythical place. Oh, what do you mean, mythical? Mr. Gupta, this is the place that nobody can find on the map. <laughs> When I got the call from Shabir yesterday from that Durban country club place, and he practically begged me to bring fruit and veg here for you and the boys, I wasn't surprised. You know? Boss, the O's in Durban know if you need something done right the first time, there's only one O for the graph, Harry. Uh, who is this Harry? Me, Lani, I'm Harry. Oh, yes, 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 yes. No, no, thousand apologies. Thousand no, no, apologies. No, 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 no need to apologize. But we were talking about Dubai, man. Dubai. Dubai. Yeah. Dubai. Oh, come, Harry. Let's face it, where is there a better place in the Middle East for billionaires to have a playground? Sure. That's a tough question. <laughs> I wanted to talk to you about that, Lani. Shabir Chunmi put a word in for me. Well, he did say that you are not the brightest bulb. He, he reckon I'm not the brightest bulb. That's what he said. But that's because I'm an energy saver, Lani. <laughs> the characters may have been con men, but the show certainly wasn't a fiddle, earning the actors hearty applause. The show was awesome. It was brilliant. Good comedy. Very entertaining. We really enjoyed it. You should miss it. Vikash and Jack are a hilarious and brave pair to be reckoned with. I grew up watching them and their talent and passion is so inspiring. I cannot wait to see how Harry and the Gupta and these men keep growing. The scene in the foyer told the story with fans queuing out for the selfies with Jack and Vikash. Or was that Harry and Rajesh? You just couldn't be sure.